Hey everyone, it's James Franklin again with Newton County Fire. So as we uh, enjoy our last day of Fire Prevention Week, I hope you've learned some new tips uh, how you can be safe in case uh, in the event of a fire. And the last thing we're going to talk about is fire is deadly. Okay, so it says smoke and toxic gases kill more people than flames do. So I know in the movies, uh, a lot of time when there's a fire, uh, we actually don't even see smoke. I guess that wouldn't make for good TV, but uh, actually, like it says, smoke is toxic. It has a lot of chemicals inside of it. Uh, you may think that you'd be able to walk through the smoke and just cough, but I promise you all the toxins in that, you know, are deadly. Uh, that's why it's so important that we stay below that smoke line and once we're out we stay out We can't risk going back inside That's why firefighters wear all of our gear and our air packs because we don't want to breathe that stuff in either uh, Not only is it deadly uh, It's also uh, there's a lot of carcinogens in it that can give us cancer so uh, since you don't have any of that special gear uh, when there's a fire, we've got to have you stay low below that smoke line and get out and stay out. Okay. So just to review smoke alarms, we've got to have them in our house, right? And they've got to be working smoke alarms. That means if the battery is chirping, the smoke alarm is chirp chirping, you've got to replace that battery. Now, if you don't have working smoke alarms, Newton County Fire can help you with that. Uh, if you can call 678-212-5411, Newton County Firefighters will come out to your house and install smoke alarms for free. Uh, that's because smoke alarms save lives and we're able to provide that for you. So again, if you need those, uh, call 678-212. 212-5411 and we'd be glad to help you with that and also we need you to come up with a fire escape plan and uh, that's something we're teaching your children at school over the coming weeks and uh, so when they come home at night ask them about what they learned and as a family come up with your own fire escape plan so you know uh, multiple ways out of your house and not only draw it up but practice it. We definitely need to practice that about twice a year. Okay. All right. Well, thanks for listening this week and uh, be safe. Thank you.